Glory to the Lord. Hallelujah. We thank the Lord today for His loving kindness, for His interventions He showered upon us and the all that belong to us. May His name be glorified. The Bible says, in all your ways, I acknowledge Him. So, I thank the Lord for His manifold mercies and grace. He has shown unto us in Jesus' name. I thank the Lord you are there to join me today in the analysis. May the good Lord bless you and grant your heart desires according to His will in Jesus' name. Join me now as we go in the Unlawful Sexual Relationship Series. Yes, today by His grace we continue. In the Vitico chapter 18, I will read 7 now. The nakedness of thy father or the nakedness of thy mother shall thou not uncover. She is thy mother, thou shalt not uncover her nakedness. You know, every human being have sexual urge in him or her. Everyone. Of course, God created men and female. So everyone, male, female, have such a urge in him or in her. Whether human being, whether animal. But why we are different from animal is that we have sense of reasoning. So the Lord is saying, the Lord God is saying, where you have sexual urge, don't go and relieve it with your father as a woman or as a lady. Where you have sexual urge, don't go and relieve it with your mother as a son. Don't do that. Don't engage in an unlawful sexual relationship with your father as a woman or with your mother as a man, as a son, as a daughter. Don't do so. Because it's unlawful. It's unlawful. It's not permitted. It's not, it's not allowed by the creator of heaven and earth on whose terms the heaven and earth are wrong. Not on your own terms, on my own terms. Every other nation take their law from God's law. That's where extract their own laws, which is called constitution today, all over the world. What is bad is bad. What is unlawful is unlawful. Don't live a lawless life. Verse 8. The nakedness of thy father's wife shall thou not uncover. It is thy father's nakedness. Here he is saying, suppose their father married multiple women. Their father have two, three, four wives. Your father is a polygamous man, and your family is a polygamous family. He said, don't go and sleep with your father's wife. Don't have unlawful sexual relationship with your father's wife. It's unlawful. If you do that, it's as good as if you are doing that with your father. You are honoring your father. You are seeing your father's nakedness. So, don't have anything to do with your father wife if your father is a polygamous man with multiple women as wives. There was a scripture that says that a man went and slept with his father's wife. It's unlawful. It's condemnable. I want you to know this is how consequences 